Scene Script Have you ever wondered why it's crucial for pregnant women to stay active and fit? Today, we'll delve into this topic. Pregnancy is a transformative time, a period when a woman's body undergoes significant changes. It's also a time when staying active can play a vital role in maintaining optimal health. The importance of training pregnant women cannot be overstated, as it benefits both the mother and her baby in numerous ways. One of the key advantages of staying active during pregnancy is that it helps manage weight gain. Pregnancy naturally involves gaining weight, but regular exercise can help ensure that this gain remains within a healthy range. This not only helps the mother maintain her overall health, but also reduces the risk of complications during delivery. Physical activity during pregnancy also contributes to improved mental health. It's no secret that pregnancy can be an emotional roller coaster, with hormones causing mood swings and sometimes leading to feelings of anxiety or depression. Regular exercise has been proven to boost mood and reduce stress, providing a natural mood enhancer during this pivotal period. And let's not forget about the baby. Studies have shown that when a pregnant woman exercises it can lead to improved cardiovascular health for the baby. This means that by staying active, a mother can help set the foundation for her child's future health. Yet it's not just about the physical benefits. Training during pregnancy can also build strength and endurance, which can be beneficial during labor and delivery. It can help pregnant women maintain their stamina and may even make the recovery process smoother post-birth. As we explore this topic further, it's important to remember that every pregnancy is unique. What works for one woman may not work for another. That's why it's essential to consult with a healthcare professional before starting or continuing any exercise routine during pregnancy. They can provide guidance tailored to individual needs and ensure that physical activity is done safely. Staying physically active during pregnancy brings numerous health benefits, but it's crucial to do it right and safe. So join us as we delve deeper into this topic and provide tips on how to train pregnant women effectively and safely. First and foremost, understanding the changes a pregnant body goes through is essential. Pregnancy is a time of significant physical transformation. The body undergoes numerous alterations to accommodate the growing baby. One of the most noticeable changes is the shift in the body's center of gravity, which can affect balance. Moreover, hormonal fluctuations during pregnancy increase joint and ligament flexibility, which may enhance susceptibility to injury if not appropriately addressed. Additionally, the body's endurance levels may fluctuate, as the cardiovascular system works harder to support both the mother and the growing fetus. These changes aren't just about the growing belly, they are about the entire body adapting to a new stage of life. It's crucial to keep these changes in mind when designing a training program for a pregnant woman. The exercises should be tailored to meet her current fitness level and the modifications her body is undergoing. Adapting the training to these changes will ensure a safe and effective workout. Secondly, we need to focus on moderate intensity exercises. What does this entail? Well, moderate intensity exercises are those that raise your heart rate and make you sweat, yet still allow you to carry on a conversation. Think brisk walking, swimming, or prenatal yoga. Why is this important? High intensity workouts, while beneficial in some circumstances, may not be suitable for pregnant women. They can lead to elevated heart rates and exhaustion, which isn't the goal here. Instead, the aim is to maintain a healthy level of physical activity that supports both the mother and the baby's well-being. Remember, pregnancy isn't the time to push for new fitness records or attempt strenuous routines. It's a time for gentle nurturing, keeping the body active and maintaining overall health. This approach helps ensure a smoother pregnancy, easier labor, and quicker postpartum recovery. Remember, it's about staying active and healthy, not setting new personal records. Our third tip is about strength training. Strength training is not just for bodybuilders, it is also essential for pregnant women. It can help to increase stamina, which can be incredibly beneficial during labor. Not only that, strength training also aids in managing some common discomforts of pregnancy such as backache and fatigue. Now, let's talk about safe and effective strength exercises for pregnant women. Exercises such as squats, lunges and gentle weightlifting can be incorporated into the routine. Remember the goal here isn't to lift heavy or push boundaries but rather to maintain a level of fitness that supports a healthy pregnancy. It is also essential to always keep proper form and posture during these exercises. If done correctly, strength training can even help improve posture and decrease some common pregnancy complaints like backaches and fatigue, 
So don't shy away from those weights. Strength training can help manage pregnancy discomfort and prepare for childbirth. Fourthly, let's not forget about flexibility and balance. These two elements are crucial during pregnancy. Why, you might ask? Well, as the baby grows, a woman's center of gravity shifts forward, which can disrupt her balance. This makes pregnant women more prone to falls and injuries. That's where flexibility and balance exercises come into play. Exercises like gentle yoga or Pilates can help improve both flexibility and balance. They stretch the muscles, increase body awareness, and help maintain good posture. Remember, the focus here isn't on pushing to extremes but rather on maintaining a comfortable range of motion. Another good exercise is a simple walking regimen. Walking is a low-impact exercise that maintains flexibility and balance while also strengthening the cardiovascular system. It's a win-win. And let's not forget about the benefits of reducing discomfort. Improved flexibility can ease common pregnancy issues like back pain and muscle cramps. Improving flexibility and balance can prevent falls and ease pregnancy discomfort. Our fifth and final tip is perhaps the most important one, listen to the body. In the world of fitness and especially when training pregnant women, the body is the ultimate guide. It tells us when to push harder, when to pull back, and when to rest. During pregnancy, the body undergoes a myriad of changes and it's essential to tune in and listen to what it's saying. Sometimes the body sends subtle signals, a slight discomfort in the lower back, a twinge in the hips, or a general feeling of fatigue. These are not signs to be ignored or brushed off. They're messages from the body signaling that it's time to slow down or modify the activity. But the body doesn't always whisper its needs. Sometimes it shouts, sharp pain, dizziness, shortness of breath or contractions that don't stop when the activity is ceased. These are all loud and clear signals that it's time to stop. These are not signs to be taken lightly. If experienced, it's essential to cease the activity immediately and consult a healthcare provider. So, how do we listen to the body? It starts with awareness. Encourage your trainee to be mindful of how she's feeling during every part of the workout. Is she comfortable? Is she breathing easily? Is she feeling any pain or discomfort? This constant check-in allows for immediate adjustments to be made to ensure the safety and comfort of both the mother and the baby. It's also important to remember that every day is different during pregnancy. What felt good one day might not feel the same the next. That's perfectly okay. It's not a setback, it's just the nature of the journey. So, the next time you're training a pregnant woman, remember to pause, listen, and adjust. Listen to the body's whispers and its shouts. Adjust the workout accordingly to ensure the safety and comfort of your trainee. Remember, every day is different during pregnancy. It's okay to adjust the intensity and duration of workouts based on how you're feeling. Now that we've covered the basics, let's do a quick recap. We started by understanding why training during pregnancy is critical. It helps keep both the mother and the baby healthy and aids in quicker postpartum recovery. But it's not just about exercising for the sake of it. It's about doing it right and safely. The first tip we discussed was understanding the changes in a pregnant body. Pregnancy isn't a one-size-fits-all experience. It's a unique journey for every woman, with specific needs and limitations. As trainers, we must be aware of these changes and adapt our training methods accordingly. Next, we emphasized focusing on moderate-intensity exercises. It's not about pushing the boundaries, but maintaining a healthy and active lifestyle. Moderate-intensity exercises such as brisk walking or swimming can help maintain a healthy weight and enhance overall well-being. We then moved on to the importance of incorporating strength training. This doesn't mean lifting heavy weights. Rather, it's about strengthening the core and pelvic muscles to support the growing belly and prepare the body for childbirth. Following strength training, we discussed prioritizing flexibility and balance. Pregnancy can throw off a woman's balance, making her more prone to falls. Exercises that enhance flexibility and balance like yoga and Pilates can help counteract these effects. Lastly, we stress the importance of listening to the body. Pregnancy is a time of significant change and no one knows a woman's body better than she does. If something doesn't feel right during exercise, it's crucial to stop and consult a healthcare professional. Training during pregnancy is not just about physical health, but also about mental well-being. It can help reduce stress, improve mood, and contribute to a more positive pregnancy experience. Training during pregnancy can be highly beneficial if done correctly. Remember these tips and make the most out of this special time.